What is going on guys, Death here, and we're back with another video for Genshin Impact. In this one, I want to break down the brand new pass that got leaked, or the special purchase that we're going to be able to do to get 40 resin every day. Now, this is a very controversial topic because resin, well, this is something we all need. And without a shadow of a doubt, I do think that we do need something for free-to-play players to have the opportunity to get more resin. But is this a bad thing in the grand scheme of things? Now, overall, I don't think it's right that we don't have the option to farm some type of resin, condensed resin, or something within the game. But I don't think this is a bad thing. I myself am going to purchase it. And even though I understand the frustration from free to play players, I just want to say this. When the game first launched, we had 120 energy. Now we have a cap of 160. They gave us an increase of 40, right? On top of that, they also made it so we're able to have a whole bunch of Primo Gems with these events pretty much on a daily basis. With the daily commissions, we're pretty much able to get one free refill every day. That is, of course, if we're not trying to roll for characters or weapons. After all this time, they decided to add another 40, you know, resin to the game, but is via pay to win per se you do have to pay in order to get this but i don't think it's wrong they added 40 you know a cap of 40 because before it was filling out way too quickly to the free to play players well to everybody but it really impacted the free to play players and now they added 40 resin via paying methods i don't think this is wrong at all i actually think it's really good and i do understand where you guys are coming from from the free to play side but i'm not saying this is the absolute best and that this is the solution to the you know primo gen problem but rather a good addition to the game because like i've said before i'm a console player so i honestly think that giving us the option to pay a little bit extra because it's only five ten dollars a month pretty much it's not that much when you're spending a lot more money on skins, maybe on a whole game or even DLC. So overall, I think this is a good thing. I'm pretty excited, but I know it's going to be a very controversial topic. So do let me know your opinion in the comment section below. For now, hit that like button, subscribe, turn on bell notifications so you're up to date every time we post a video. And I'll be seeing you guys next time, you boy Death Gun. Out.